Hello friends, so this is the eighth question related to block diagram reduction. So this is the block diagram uh, which we want to simplify and uh, here we'll be making the changes in this blue portion. Okay, so here like uh, we approach in all the previous block diagram problems we have to pick a spot where we can start applying the block diagram reduction rule any spot any point where you think you can apply the block diagram reduction rule you should do that okay so here if you see this takeoff point if we shift it here ahead of this uh, block g3 then we will get a negative feedback path uh, this involving g3 and h2 okay and also then we can simplify it from right to left so first step is shifting this takeoff point here so the basic mechanism which will happen here is that we have this block a AG. So here the takeoff point is behind. We have to shift it here. So whenever you shift takeoff point ahead or behind a block, the value of the takeoff point should remain the same. Here the value is A. So when we'll shift it here, naturally it will become AG. So if we use a 1 by G block here, if we pass it through a 1 by G block then it will become A. So here also we will do the same thing. When we shift the takeoff point here, we will use a 1 by G3 block here. G3 block here so that when it passes through this it will become the same okay a or so these two blocks are in cascade so we can further simplify to become h3 by g3 h3 by g3 h3 by g3 this then this is a negative feedback path you can see it will become g3 by 1 plus g3 h2 so directly we'll do that g3 by 1 plus g3 h2 g3 by 1 plus g3 H2 this again these two blocks are in cascade so it will become G2 G3 by 1 plus G3 H2 so it will become G2 G3 this ok up to this point it is done now what we can do is that uh, if we shift uh, this summing point behind this block G1 okay if we shift that let us see what happens okay shifting this summing point okay this summing point behind block G1 so this will happen something like this let's just see okay so it will happen something like this suppose we have a block and a summing point hmm. B. 
plus this is minus so the final output is ag minus p so whenever we make any change to it it should happen in such a way that the final output should remain unchanged so if we shift the summing point here it should be in such a way that the final output should be this is minus this is plus but here it is coming ag minus bg so this g is coming extra the bg part that we don't want so what we'll do is that if we pass this b through a 1 by g 1 by g block then it will be ag minus p we'll get ag minus p because here it will be a minus b by g into g which will be ag minus p so here also when we shift it this summing point ahead of this block g1 we will divide this with a 1 by g1 block okay a 1 by g1 block so it will happen something like this okay let us make the changes here so we want to take the summing point here so here these are the changes this is plus and here it is the summing point here will become 1 by g1 okay and there is also h3 by g3 these two there are okay that and we also have this and we have g1 okay like this so here it is like this okay this is the whole thing so this is here now these two blocks are in cascade so we can combine them to form h3 by g3 g1 h3 by g3 g1 okay h3 by g3 g1 this now we can interchange these two summing points okay we can bring this summing point here and this summing point here okay so when we do that okay basic principle is this the interchanging of summing points it is something like this this is plus let's say and let's this is minus and again this is plus and let's say this is minus c so the final output is a minus b minus c so no matter what you do if we interchange the summers the final output should remain the same so if we interchange it like this a we bring this summer here this is plus is minus c the bottom input will move along with it and again this is p so this is also a minus c minus p which is the same thing so here also if we interchange these two summers so it will be 
we want to bring this summer here this summer here so it will be okay uh, so it will be something like this which one okay this is negative here and this will come here minus this this is the whole thing so if you further simplify it it will be like this h1 okay like this this whole thing this will be like this now if you see here this one is a classic negative feedback connection g by 1 plus g h form so it will become g1 by 1 plus g1 h1 so simply we'll replace this with g1 by 1 plus g1 h1 g1 by 1 plus g1 h1 then these two blocks they will be in uh, cascade so it will get multiplied that is g1 g2 g3 by 1 plus g1 h1 into 1 plus g3 h2 so let us do that so it will become g1 g2 g3 by 1 plus g1 h1 into 1 plus g3 h2 okay again this is a classic negative feedback connection where this is the forward path gain g and this is the feedback path gain h okay so we will simply apply this g by 1 plus g h c by r this will be the whole thing so if we want to simplify it it will become so it will become g means this that is g1 g2 g3 by 1 plus g1 h1 into 1 plus g3 h2 by 1 plus this into this again g1 g2 g3 by 1 plus g1 h1 to 1 plus g3 h2 multiplied with h which means h3 by g3 g1 so here if you see g3 g1 this will get cancelled g3 g1 and here 1 plus g1 h1 into 1 plus g3 h2 these are both in the denominator of both these expressions so they will also get cancelled out so it will become the final expression will be g1 g2 g3 by 1 plus g1 h1 plus g3 h2 plus g2 h3 okay plus another thing will be uh, when we this will get multiplied okay g1 h1 g3 h2 g1 h1 g3 h2 so it will become g1 h1 g3 h2 when these two will get multiplied okay when these two will get multiplied so this will be the final expression i think this is right okay g1 g2 g3 by 1 plus g1 h2 okay g1 h1 sorry this is g1 h1 okay g1 h1 g3 h2 
G2H3 and this is G1H1 okay G1H1 G3H2 okay so this is I think right yes this is uh, yes this is the final expression okay so you also do it uh, yourself simplify it whether you are getting this expression or not okay please check so this is the final simplified expression